to the piano studio of Lisa Bailey and our continued series on the circle of fifths as we look at the minor five finger scales. This has been a lot of fun to do with you and I'm so glad you've joined me. So today we're gonna to do a little bit of review and then we're going to jump in feet first to the F sharp minor five finger scale. Let's do a quick review of the B minor five finger scale and the pattern of all minor five finger scales. So B is our tonic from the last video. So we start on B and we go whole step, half step, whole step, whole step. It's the same thing for the left hand. Tonic is B, then we go whole step, half step, whole step, whole step. Excellent. All right. So as we travel around the circle of fifths, remember we go in fifths. So a fifth up from B is our dominant, which is F sharp. That's our fifth. So now we're going to be starting on F sharp and F sharp is now our tonic. So let's build our minor five finger scale starting on F sharp. And I do want to point out too, I am way in the black keys because I have to be able to have my thumb on this starting black key. So let's build our pattern. Tonic, then we need a whole step, a half step, then a whole step, and a final whole step. Look at all of these black keys. Tonic, whole step, half step, whole step, whole step. Good. Try that out a few times. Get comfortable with that. Make sure your fingers are in the black keys. Let's build the same thing with our left hand, starting with finger five on F sharp, which is our tonic. So tonic, whole step, half step, whole step, whole step. Same thing. Both our thumb and our pinky, which is our which are our shortest fingers, are on black keys now. So what I want you to do is practice that a lot, hands separately, to get used to how that feels under your fingers and to get used to the black keys that are that your fingers are playing. It takes a little bit to get used to all of that and to get used to being in a different place on the piano. When you're ready and have done that a whole bunch of times and are comfortable, we're gonna do it hands together. So let's start slowly and carefully. with these. Let's do some improvisation together. So remember with improvisation, we always want to start off by experimenting on our own. And we've talked about this in the previous videos. You can use long notes, short notes, stepping notes, skipping notes, whatever you want, but try it out and try it in a couple of different places on the piano. different places, whatever you want to do for your improvisation. When you're ready, come back to the video and we're going to do a duet together. I have an accompaniment ready for you. Our accompaniment today for F sharp minor is in 4-4. Four, four. So I'm going to give you one measure of four beats and then we're going to come in together. One, two, three, four.
good. Do that a few times to get used to that F sharp minor five finger scale. It's a little bit trickier than the other ones because we're starting on black keys, but give yourself some time. Do that a bunch of times and see what you can come up with as far as your part with the duet. Great job on the F sharp minor five finger scale. That one is a little challenging where we're starting on black keys as our tonic, but you're doing excellent. Continue to practice each video. Remember to review each five finger scale so you don't forget. And go back and do your improvisations for each one and see what you can come up with. See how creative and inventive you can be. As always, feel free to reach out to me through the comments. And if you have any questions, you can leave them there as well. I look forward to hearing from you. Mm -hmm.